Good morning, Slevin. Only one place to start. There's been a lot of talk about the future of Dimitri Payet in, in, in recent weeks. Uh, the Joint Chairman, Mr David Sullivan, has, has come out yesterday and said that Dimitri Payet is staying here for many years to come. That must be music to your ears. Yeah, of course, the Chairman said that even uh, during Euros, when the speculation started and all that, and the Chairman said that, of course, we were and we are delighted. Uh, to have him and uh, he's our player and we want him to stay our player, of course. For the players that are here, Slavin, obviously worked very hard over the international break. One of those players, Diafro Sacco. West Ham fans are very excited to, to see him back in action. What can you tell us on the latest regarding him and his fitness? Yeah, look, uh, um, as a manager, I don't want to talk about the players when they are injured. I want to be concentrate me and my staff on the players that we can count for the games. But of course, that's why we didn't talk a lot about, about them, including the Afra Sako. But we are delighted that he's back. We, we're missing him for, uh, uh, since the start of the pre-season, basically. So it was a very long, uh, long uh, period. Now he's back. He's been training uh, first individually, like rehabilitation treatment and everything, then individually on a pitch, and then he done uh, one week with under 23s to, to, to have that contact of uh, teams, work and everything. And now he, he started to train with us uh, after the game against Stoke. And he's fit, he's good, like with Cresswell. Maybe he will need a few games to hit his top form, but he looks really good and some of the players hit it uh, straight away, like Cresswell. Say when we, if the Afrasaka plays to the form we know he's capable of, we've got a top striker to come back into our squad. Definitely, I mean uh, the Afra is kind of the player that we know. That's why he's our player and why we rate him so much. Is uh, he gives you something different? He runs deep. He's uh, he's really good in running behind the defense. That creates the opportunities for himself, but also opens the space for for some midfield players to come into that zone. That occurs when, when he runs behind him. And uh, it's a big, big boost for us, of course. Oh, Andy Carroll, what's the latest with him? Again, with Andy, it's, uh, he, he's progressing really good. So if he continues to progress like this, uh, like so far, maybe a couple of weeks' time he's going to train with us. Maybe even earlier, but I don't want to say that. So it looks really good. It looks, uh, it looks. I have to say it again. If if he continues to progress, and there's really no reason why he shouldn't, then we, we. I'm expecting uh, to have him really soon.